What's going on everybody, it's your boy Beast here Got another little recipe, another way to change your chicken Today we're going to make some mushroom chicken breast Alright, it's a real simple recipe And all you need is some chicken breast of course A cream of mushroom can You know the macros are not that bad on this It's low in calories, fat free Alright, and um, you're also going to need some soy sauce some spinach and of course you're gonna need the actual mushrooms themselves right I'm using some sliced up baby Bella mushrooms very good source of vitamin D um, just wash and you know they're ready to use right and this, this recipe goes very good with rice as you see I already have some brown rice in the back cooking all right so let's get started <clears throat> we're gonna place our chicken breast in a skillet that I'm gonna have up around medium low alright you don't really need a higher temperature than that for this recipe alright we're just gonna let everything pretty much just cook by itself it's not gonna look too appealing but it, the, the taste is definitely up there it goes perfect with the brown rice maybe even some some whole wheat egg noodles alright just dump those mushrooms in there after you wash them of course rinse them out then we're going to put in our can of cream of mushroom soup with a little bit of water. Alright, we're just going to place that over the mushrooms. And that's it. We're going to add the soy sauce. Then we're going to cover it. And we're just going to let it cook for about an hour. We're just going to let it sit there at that medium low temperature for like an hour. Alright, like I said earlier, it doesn't it look too appealing. Looks downright nasty actually. But it tastes really good. It's a perfect combination with, you know, your carb of choice. And after about an hour or so, you know, we're going to dump in some of that spinach. All right. And after we dump the spinach, we could just turn the heat off, cover it, and just let it sit there for a good 10 minutes or so. About 10 minutes before you actually serve. You know, you don't want to overcook the spinach. We want to make sure we get all those nutrients, as much of them as possible. Some of that vitamin K. Alright, just turn the heat off, cover it again, and put it on a plate 10 minutes from now. Alright, and this is what it looks like. Again, it looks kind of slimy, you know, not too appealing, but the taste is very, very exotic very just different than what you might be used to and this is just another way of making your chicken breast so you don't get bored of the same old same old you heard i appreciate you guys watching y'all be good y'all hold it down